So if you have two bottles and you put a small amount of water in each of them, and I hope that's nearly the same note. Not being very musical, I'm very bad at telling this, but um, uh, what I'm now going to do is add an Elka seltzer to one of these. And the idea is to think about what will happen to the note that is produced when we've added this. So I don't know if anyone's got any suggestions. Uh, I'll just leave it for a short time. So we've added something into there, so it's producing some carbon dioxide, I suppose. So I'm just going to, oh, this is the original bottle. Mm -hmm. So it's gone lower. So does anyone know why it's gone lower? In fact, it's, it's, it's because of the carbon dioxide you've produced, and actually it's the speed of sound in the carbon dioxide. And you can show that, in fact, this sort of small change in height produced by adding the, the alpha seltzer is, is minimal. If I blow the carbon dioxide out, and then try and... They're, they're, they're much closer again in, in, in um, sound. 